love. Why not? Let's talk about it. It's amazing. Someone was talking about OKKO and it's like, yeah, well, it's coming back in a few months. And it's like, okay. And well, it turns out as soon as it came back, it's now officially canceled or it finished its run. I'm not sure, but three seasons, huh? My goodness. <laughs> yeah, it's like, my goodness, let's do the count right now. We got Steven Universe. They finished it this year. They finished up now. Okay. Okay, KO, let's be heroes. And I'm like, oh my gosh, you're now losing shows? And you guys showed Apple and Onion and you still didn't show it. But yeah, I'm not, I'm not going to complain about that. But gee whiz, man. I mean, you're taking out the good heavy hitters who actually was telling some good stories. I mean, Steven Universe, it took kind of like, it went from you suck at making promos because the promo made it seem stupid as hell. But it turns out it was pretty damn good. And it's just your fault, Cartoon Network, for your stupid promo. You suck. But it turns out Steven Universe was actually very, very good. Even though Steven was stupid when he was in the first few episodes or first few seasons. Okay, KO, however, it was actually a fun show. And wow, I mean, they even made the Secret Saturdays their very last episode. So it turns out that probably... It might have been canceled and they told them this is their last season. And if they did, then most likely the final episode was like, oh, well, here's all the episodes we were planning. It's like maybe they did the whole um, Jump Street 22, which they were like, yeah, here's everything that we want to do in the future. And we just want to show you the very final thing to show that Kale actually grew up and look how awesome he is. Man, you guys even did the freaking X Men Evolution thing going on there, <laughs> you know? Because X Men Evolution, they finished with five seasons, but they were like, "Well, here's more stuff that we wanted to tell you, but we most likely won't or didn't want to touch upon it." Which is like, wow, they definitely didn't want to touch on the Phoenix Force, but the Phoenix Force was gonna happen. It may be season six or seven, I'm not sure. And then they showed that Magneto actually joined the X-Men. It's like, whoa, there was just some crazy stuff that's like, whoa, what happened in the future of X-Men Evolution? But we won't get it because, well, they ended it. So they ended it and we get to see like all these other episodes to happen. And of course, well, they showed that they teamed up with um, Captain Planet. That's crazy. They got Sonic to join in and Sonic actually is his vanilla form to actually like chili dogs. So that's good because if you got Sonic X, I would have just jumped ship. <laughs> but all seriousness, though, OK, KO is going away seriously that was a good one and what's worse is just that it's the mistreatment of shows that are pretty damn good you have steaming universe and then all of a sudden it's like well the movie's coming we should definitely make sure we hype it up <laughs> instead it's like why didn't you hype it up all month long all year long it's like you made it to the end and then as soon as you made it to the end episode no more Steven Universe unless you're op waking up early in the freaking damn morning. Or basically, you're going to be like, oh, the app, the app, the app. Oh, good for you. But we don't want to hear Team Titans go, go, go. Why don't we use the app for Team Titans go and can shove his freaking ass away? Because, geez, you're talking about the app so much. Why don't you just allow Team Titans go to be on the app and go crazy on the app instead of being go crazy on the channel like freaking dumbass SpongeBob over there? It's getting stupid. And it's like, yeah, you might as well just, you can, you can, it's like, when it comes to shows, you can sacrifice 30 minutes, can't you? You can sacrifice 15 minutes, can't you? You could have done Steven Universe and, um, Steven Universe and OK, KLSB Heroes. You could just sacrifice maybe even an hour. It's like, not an hour for the show. I mean, you could at least sacrifice 30 minutes each for each show. I mean, gee whiz. It's like, I really hope the case isn't, oh, yeah, we made sure we rushed them. <laughs> we need to give more room for more shows or technically for Team Titans Go. We need more room for that. And it's like, why in the world are you still freaking going for Team Titans Go? Personally, you backed the wrong pony. You destroyed DC Universe, DC Nation. You destroyed that crap and you kept Team Titans Go. Really? Personally, I would have just told you no keep DC universe DC nation and screw over Team Titans go 
Teen Titans Go was a dumbass short. It should have stayed a short. It's like you bagged the wrong horse and you're going to continue to bag the wrong horse for some stupid reason. I will say this. If OKKO, okay, if the corrector and all that stuff, if all of them are like, yeah, that's exactly what we wanted to do. We definitely just wanted to have three seasons. We we're done. It's like, okay, cool. Now, if it's the story of the freaking Cartoon Network was like, well, we're canceling you. We're just giving you a notice. So, you know, yeah, there you go. <laughs> it's like, my goodness, what the freaking damn hell? It's like, oh, the Teen Titans go. Yes, more seasons, more seasons, more seasons. Oh, um, OK, KO, Steven Universe, um, all you other shows, freak you. You might get a new season or you're canceled. Go fuck yourself. That's what it seems like to me. It's just basically... To go fuck yourself. <laughs> it's like at least they're maybe te they're maybe keeping total drama rama, even though it's pretty stupid, but it is kind of funny. And at least it's not freaking pooping on what's going on the freaking Teen Titans. I mean, it's pooping on its name. It continues to poop on his name right now. And I'm like, that's the real reason. It would have been cool if you just call it TTG and just be like, yeah, the Teen Titans, but we don't call it that. And that would have been okay. Like Francis told her, I bet chances are there's many people who love total drama and they're like, oh my gosh, what the fuck did you do? You continue to do this to so many shows, decided to make baby versions of them. Even baby Looney Tunes had one and then superhero squad from freaking Marvel. It's like, oh my gosh, when will this end? And like, I understand you, man. But for me, I'm not really a fan of t total drama. So Watching that show is pretty damn funny, except for the fat ass. <laughs> and pretty soon, I bet they're going to go at the throat of Amazing World of Gumball and kill him, too. It's like, my goodness, are you ever going to keep shows and have good shows and last this long? Because Infinity Train is a good one, but you're going to make it seasonal. And that's sad. It's like it's not even the fact of where it's like you used to be cool in October and then all of a sudden you decide to just say fuck it. And that's pretty messed up. It really is. It's messed up freak up. But okay, KO is like it's a sucky choice. I mean, I don't think I saw all the episodes just like Steven Universe. I haven't saw all the episodes. As soon as they did the marathon, I saw mostly all the episodes. I still missed a few of them, but holy crap, there was more story that needed to be looked at. And whose fault is it that I didn't get to see the episodes? You did the same damn episodes again and don't show me actually episodes that I really needed to look at. What the frick, Cartoon Network? What the frick? With... I guess with OKKO, OK that's still the same thing, too, because I think I missed the last episode of that one, too. But here you are being like, oh, but we need to show the camp thing of to of Team Titans Go. No, you freaking damn don't. OK, no, you damn don't. How about you allow me to understand a story more of OKKO OK to actually understand why TKO is now out and about and holy frick. It's like, gee whiz, man. But for it to go. It's like, I understand it needs to go, but dude, this is two shows already going away. And eventually within a few months, it's going to be gone from Cartoon Network, period. And yes, you have to app, but still it's like, oh, uh, here we go. Even more time for freaking Teen Titans Go. Here we go again with this bull crap. And it's like, my goodness. It's like, do you remember the shows that they said that there was going to be? Yeah, I think I do. I think they showed them all, but sadly, I think many of them are not going to show their face again until summer. That's the sad truth. Summer. So it's like, my goodness. So you're just going to have, well, they have Total Drama Rama again. They have Amazing World of Gumball and they have Teen Titans Go. That's all the shows they have. That is all the freaking damn shows they have excluding the ones that they do in the early morning but they don't really count because they don't show them anywhere else but early morning but she freaking whiz man <laughs> it's like can we space out the freaking conclusion of series a year you know just once a year you take down the show not oh yeah they've been doing good kind of this time they just took out two and it's like oh crap well, what you guys are going to do now? I mean, 
are you going to, they're most likely still going to show OKKO, OK but they're going to discontinue him very, very shortly. Just like Steven Universe, they're going to continue, discontinue him very, very shortly. And it's like, you see how the messed up mistreatment of them all? And yes, I know they did allow TKO be on Saturdays and stuff, but it's like, at that time, I'm doing stuff, man. <laughs> And as soon as I look in like old Cartoon Network, here's Teen Titans Go. And I'm like, yeah, how about this? Frick Teen Titans Go. Put it somewhere where I don't get to see it and allow the shows I want to see be put on the time that I want to see them, that I want to actually watch Cartoon Network. Not, oh crap, now I need to ditch. <laughs> it's like, okay, I need to ditch. Go to True TV. Go to Nickelodeon. Maybe Disney can save me. Oh my gosh, I said Disney can save me. I need to just jump off a bridge. <laughs> uh, but it's really messed up right now. It really is messed up that you're continuing to cancel shows, man. It's like, what's next? Are you going to cancel Amazing World of Gumball? Are we going to turn Cartoon Network into Teen Titans Go Channel? Is that what we're doing? Because if this is what we're doing... I guess it's truly the end of Cartoon Network as we know it. It has fully grown and turned into a freaking idiot nut job. And I bet Nickelodeon themselves even wish they could do that crap. But they have some sense. I mean, they have many shows. They have some sense. They spam out freaking SpongeBob. But you don't see them actually canceling so many shows just to have SpongeBob to still be present. Yeah, I think right now the tally is they canceled one show. I think that's the tally. The tally is they canceled one show. They canceled, um, what was it? Um, Night Squad. They canceled that. So they canceled that show. I don't remember they canceled anything else. But as you can see, well, they canceled most likely Kid Danger, the cartoon show. I think that got killed. So, but they had a reason to kill Kid Danger because why? I mean, yes, they were trying to keep it alive. So just in case he's like, oh, crap, he's too grown up. They can't really believe him to be a teenage superhero. And it's like, well, at least we have this cartoon show to jump into. And I was like, my goodness, what the freak? <laughs> uh, what the freak? And then that's for Night Squad. Night Squad, I wish they still continued it because it seemed like it's been cut short. There's so much stuff they could do. But well, anyways, TKO, I mean. Okay, KO, let's be heroes is gone. It is gone, but hey, at least we saw the full potential of KO and it actually ended very nicely. It's just that kind of wish we could have had like a little bit more time considering they just canceled. Freak, I just forgot what show they just canceled. Oh, Steven Universe. Yeah, that was great storytelling and they canceled it. And then okay ko and it's like yeah but they did have some story continuing you know they had the story secretly embedded in it and that was cool it's like they did exactly what cartoon network wanted but they also actually had some story driven in there too which of course you know teen titans go has nothing whatsoever connecting whatsoever they have nothing nothing my goodness my gosh made this show rest in peace again damn it cartoon network stop mistreating your shows just because team titans go is your whore doesn't mean you should just simply say oh it's okay that show can just not be shown anywhere they have the app and i'm like i want to watch it on tv the app is very very damn small I mean, come on, it's on a tablet, it's on your phone. Why the hell I want to look at a small screen when I have a TV screen? Think, Cartoon Network, think.